This is our annual showcase for undergraduate research and scholarship in the college. So um, students from across the university come and they do poster presentations or oral presentations. And, and in many cases, this is kind of the capstone experience of their undergraduate career here. So a lot of times this is their senior project or their capstone for their, for their honors thesis. Um, so it's a great way for us to learn about all the research that the students are involved in. It's a great way for them to get professional practice talking about the research. Um, and it's just a wonderful way for us to learn about all the great things that our students are involved in, all the research that they're doing, because we do value strongly you know, research and critical thinking in our students. So this is a great way to see where that's happening, how it's happening. And it's also nice to see the enthusiasm of the students when they talk about their projects and research. You can really see that this is something that they have really dug into and it has really enhanced their experience here at Mason and then within the college. I could not believe it. I was very excited. Um, you know, I just can't believe that I won. It's very exciting. My research was mainly focused on non-suicidal self-injurious behavior, and I had two research questions that I was looking at. The first one is whether dispositional variables of anger, depression, anxiety, shame, and guilt, if they can predict a presence or absence of the behavior. And the second question was whether they can predict um, the reasons that people maintain these behaviors based on either social or automatic functions. For the honors program, I've been doing this project for three semesters now. I started it last spring. So it's definitely, I put a lot of work into it and time, but it has been like the best experience. Um, doing the research, going through all the different parts of it is very exciting, especially as an undergraduate, because not a lot of um, people get to experience that. So it's definitely been very exciting, and although difficult, definitely rewarding. It's been a long time coming. We've been working on our honors theses for about a year and a half now, and this is sort of the culmination of it, making this poster and presenting it out to the public. Um, and it feels great to finally be done. Um, it's been a lot more work than I expected, but yeah, I think it's worth it. I think it was interesting explaining my uh, research to people that aren't necessarily involved in anthropology or archaeology. Um, it, it's easy to get really insular and insulated in your discipline and talk about it to people that know what's going on. Um, but when you have to explain it to a psychology major, I'm, I'm not a psychologist and they're not an anthropologist. So I thought that was interesting. Definitely nerve wracking, <laughs> like very nerve wracking. Um, but I feel like it was a great experience because I do want to go into um, being a professor and a researcher and a scholar. So um, this is a great first indication of what it's going to be like talking to people all the time, preventing re or presenting research and things like that. I just really love undergraduate research symposiums because it, it allows you to get a taste of a lot of different areas at one time. Um, so like I've been involved in my research pretty much for an entire year, like not really coming up for air. And these sorts of events is just really fun because I get to see people's posters about what they've done in literature, what they've done in art, what they've done in economics. And so just sort of that ability to get a taste of like what a lot of people are doing in a lot of different areas is really great because you find yourself really immersed in your own work. But being able to look at what everybody else has done in and outside of your field is really great. The research symposium is a great opportunity for students to practice their verbal skills to practice presentation and coming up with uh, a research topic and conclusions. So it's it's a great uh, idea and uh, for my senior year I hope to be able to present another time.